believe in this. You can see the water just came in and it's actually going out back. Normally the, normally the beach must be all the way by those boats. This flag, that's all the way there it is. But you can see so many flags being put in this way. With, with bamboo. So I don't know. When the wind, as you can see, when they get knocked down, it lies on the floor here. It creates a lot of pollution. Um, garbage, but a lot of clouds, similar clouds lying here. So I think there needs to be some regulation for this beach area here. And have like police probably patrolling here to see if people throw in dumping garbage. Thing like that. Because it's not a good image of Guyana. The last time I was here this beach was very clean and beautiful actually. Alright, we are about to leave here right now and get him back out. But by the water is high, the beach is very small now, but now the water goes all the way out. And the beach looks bigger then. Alright, so we can head him back out of the beach, this road was done. At least very good you could drive in here now because you have a, a better road than the last time I came. When guys were stuck <laughs> on the road here. So this is, but they should actually put concrete here and make it, because this loom is gonna wash out after a while. You can see that the edges are already starting to wash. So if they could make like a permanent brick, drop some brick and sand here, they should hold it, you can see right here, it's going to be a problem later, right here, that's like a little drain they put underneath here, but once that wood breaks, it's going to create a big drain there, so as I was saying, the, the beach is not up to standard like it used to be, and I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed anymore. Because it's dirty. Too much of pollution. Garbage all over the place. You see this piece is very nice. This is commendable. So for an improvement of the beach they need to have like patrols. Beach patrols. Yeah. That should be that should be something of a job. If people work and they should that's the work to be done. And then you should have a crew going around and picking up garbage. So you create employment for everybody. Huh? At least and they probably could charge a fee even to go in at the beach to cover the expense. If it's clean and nice. So I'd rather go there for a clean beach, not a dirty beach. This is just my suggestion. But as I said, this road is a good improvement from the last time I was here. And here on the left is like a lot of, a lot of cattle in a dirty pen. You can see those in a dirty pen. I don't know how those animals survive there. It's soft and wet. That's like punishment for animals to me. The animals are supposed to be in a dry spot. You know, so I don't know what's going on there. Whoever is responsible for those animals should be investigated because you cannot have animals like that standing in that wet thing. Who knows for how long they've been there. And the sun is out, there's hardly any shade there for them. So I don't know who will do those All right, this is just a note from me. I hope the authorities look into this later. I'm just highlighting.
Uh, we are out now, back on the main road now. And we're heading down to Skelden, or towards Skelden. And I will, I'm disappointed with that tour because I expect to see something clean. But what I'm gonna do.